12 in the morning, pop shells, for a living in, baby, gon' smell blood trail every minute, rogue wave, and you niggas no fair, when I hit them, every time I see a big, I'm Call doctor. Dying. <coughs> Jeez, man, are you okay? No, I don't think I am. So, what does this sound like to you? Sounds like you got a case of ink poisoning. Alright, Doc, I'm coming in. <coughs> <coughs> Holy shamoli, come on in, oh man! Open up, please. <laughs> so what has been your um, symptom? Well, as you heard on the phone, I got a pretty gnarly cough. Uh -huh. And uh, I think this stems back from when I got a tattoo. Uh, where do you get this tattoo? I got this at a place called Ink Poisoning Parlor. <coughs> um, pretty bad news here, man. Um, you only have two hours to live. <laughs> Scratch that. Only one hour left. <laughs> Um, so we got a policy here for people that are dying, uh, and that are suffering from ink poisoning. Um, you're gonna have to have to have the best, <laughs> you're gonna have to have the best dinner of your life. Top notch food. Um, we'll bring you there in a little bit. Okay. Have a good day. So today we're making slap a la mop for a very special guest. First, you need the barbecue sauce. Oh, smells delightful. You just gotta tap it when it doesn't come out. Perfect. That's the first step to slap a la mop. Next, you need the jam. Next, you need can milk. Delightful. Next thing you need is a spoon mm -hmm. and a sugar. Mm -hmm. You know what? Ditch the spoon. This is going to get a little bit messy, so we're going to have to step outside. Just please follow me. Um, can you please get the door for me? No, to be fair, this is for a really special guest, so you can't mess it up. You gotta do it perfectly. Perfect. Mmm, 
Now this is just a drink. Just a reminder. Uh, now you need one more thing, and that is the cherry, but we have to use some improv right here and marshmallows. See, now, large marshmallows is the best because it just brings the flavor together. You got to just dump it in there, and that's going to be the main substance of the drink. The foundation of the drink. So, a good chef always cleans up their mess. So that is just the drink. So, I'll just put this over there real quick. Just gotta put this over here real quick. Now, it's time for the food. Next is the foundation of our meal. Now we need the foundation of the foundation. Let me just look for this real quick. Oh, so maybe it's up. So uh, I almost forgot my play here. Uh, this is all natural. We got this from a tree. <laughs> oh yeah. Now the foundation of the food. is going to be God heck. Some brown cam. And some fromage parmesan. You, this is a uh, pretty messy here, but some Parmesan cheese, just to make everything, just a foundation. So I'm going to be one more ingredient to the food here, and, and that is the ketchup. Now this is just the foundation of it, so this will be the last bit. Hopefully he enjoys it. See now, the patient here, he likes everything natural, so I don't want him to be discomforted. So, we're just going to have the foundation on here. <laughs> um, so this is the foundation of the whole thing. Can you please open the door for me? No problem. Thank you, man. So, this right here looks pretty good. Hope he enjoys it. <laughs> oh. oh, you could make it, buddy. <laughs> <coughs> it's okay, buddy. Yeah, so the um, the chef wanted to leave me and you peace. <laughs> me and you peace, so uh, we can just eat in private because the chef didn't want to disturb us. So come over here. What shall I start with first? <laughs> the food looks pretty appetizing. Okay, every. Whatever, <laughs> whatever you say. I get it. Dip it in the sauce. No, they're the right there. Bon appetit. Uh, 
How did you enjoy your first portion? Good. <laughs> <laughs> How is it? Here, uh, just take a mouthful of this. Mmm, delicious. That was delicious. <laughs> I'm sick of being treated this way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>